In this video, we'll look at the oxidation number for Cr. This is chromium. Chromium can have a number of different oxidation states depending what it's bonded to. But when it's just Cr, no positive or negative signs after it, it's neutral. And when it's neutral, the oxidation numbers for neutral substances, they add up to zero. We call this a free element. Oxidation number is zero, like Na or Fe or even H2O2 or S8, all the same element, that's a free element, oxidation number is zero. So we could say for chromium, just Cr, that would be zero. Let's take a look at an equation here. So in this equation, we have chromium plus oxygen gas, and we get this Cr2O3. Right here, it's just Cr. That's going to be an oxidation number of zero because it's a free element. Oxygen the same, it's just oxygen. So oxidation number is zero. But when it bonds, when these two, the chromium and the oxygen bond, we end up with Cr2O3. Now we have to use these rules to figure out the oxidation number on the chromium. So oxygen, that's always going to be minus 2, with just a few exceptions. Minus 2. So this is going to be 3 times minus 2. That's minus 6. In order for this to balance out, we have to have a plus 3 here. 2 times 3, that gives us plus 6. 3 times minus 2, that's minus 6, they balance out. Each chromium is going to have an oxidation number of plus 3. Let's try a few more. So for CrCl2, we look at the chlorine here. That's in group 17. It'll have an oxidation number of minus 1. 2 times minus 1, that's minus 2. This has to be plus 2. For the Cr2O3, we just did that. But remember, oxygen, always minus 2, so we have a minus 6. Have to have a plus 3 here. 2 times plus 3 gives us plus 6. That balances out each chromium's plus 3. Finally, over here, minus 2 for the oxygen. 3 times minus 2 is minus 6. Chromium is going to be a plus 6. So you can see in each instance, depending on what it's bonded to, we have a plus 2, a plus 3, and a plus 6. And there are other oxidation states that chromium can have as well when it's bonded to different elements. If we just have the chromium by itself, though, that's a free element oxidation number is zero. This is Dr. B with the oxidation numbers for chromium. Thanks for watching.